Uh, the most exciting thing about my role is definitely deploying onto warships uh, with the Royal Navy on the front line, getting to see um, some really wonderful sights around the world, um, all whilst on an active warship, seeing helicopters whizzing around Norwegian fjords to um, small boats, uh, crossing the Mediterranean Sea and doing beach landings. I'm Natalie Anders. Uh, I am a part of DSTL's Above Water Group uh, based at the Maritime Warfare Centre down at HMS Collingwood. And my role there is for land and littoral strike. Uh, so I work with the Royal Marines and the Royal Navy, office base, but also I deploy out to sea to support uh, headquarters and ships. Every day is different and getting to actually go out and see it firsthand and you know, ride on a helicopter or be in a landing craft hitting a beach is, is really exciting and gives you a real uh, understanding of what all those numbers on the spreadsheet are really about. So my role is to provide um, scientific and decision support to headquarters. So that can be reaching back to the DSTL lab. Uh, it can be providing on the spot sort of support either by say numerical modeling or researching scientific papers or providing some wargaming, providing support to the battle rhythm, combat analysis, predictions, logistics flows, all that sort of thing. Uh, and any other wild questions that they come up with that science can help out with. Being able to have that sort of scientific uh, analysis coming out of your day job and being able to present it um, up to decision makers and have it influence the way you know, the British military is evolving is, is really, really rewarding. The coolest thing I've been involved in in DSTL would probably be um, a trial for seeing if we can use uh, jetpack technology to help with Royal Marines boarding parties. I mean, it's jetpacks. Uh, flying uh, guys off ships and uh, engage people with weapons is, yeah, <laughs> very exciting. So at the moment I'm preparing to deploy again with uh, the Royal Marines and the Royal Navy. Uh, so I've been going out to the Mediterranean for four months, uh, embarked on HMS Albion. And I think I've spent about eight months at sea. I've done a birthday at sea. Um, I've not done a Christmas yet. <laughs> it's true being at sea really is like having a new family. Still uh, really heartwarmed and overwhelmed by how welcoming the Royal Navy as a community is. Pinch myself quite often and think uh, I've got a very cool job. It shows on deployment as well because I'm usually wandering around with a huge grin on my face. Yeah, why would I? Why would I want to go anywhere else?